Yeah, good people. Um, greetings. Okay. Yeah, first of all, wherever you're watching me from, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click on the subscription button, then after that, just click on the notification bell so that anytime I post a video, you'll be notified. All right. Um, it seems yesterday was, I would say, music wise, was a good day for Mother Africa. Um, because two of our giants, uh, originally from Nigeria, but I would say they are Africans, regardless. Um, Stu um, uh, Banner Boy and uh, Riskit. Uh, they won a prestigious uh, awards. Uh, uh, I would say at the Grammys. The Grammy, you know, Grammy is uh, an award scheme that every musician on this earth, um, uh, his or her wish is to win an award at the Grammys. So winning an award at the Grammys actually is something that every musician is proud of. And so uh, these two giants in Nigeria, they made us proud by winning award um, at the Grammys. All right. So after that, I, I, it seems <laughs> in Ghana, there have been trolls here and there. People are sharing their thoughts. Um, a whole lot going on in Ghana. And so through that, and uh, Stoneboy, superstar Stoneboy, also um, congratulated um, the artist that is Benna Boy at Whiskey after the won at the Grammys. And he tweeted. And after his tweet, I think Samini replied. And he said that <laughs> he threw some shots at Stoneboy, saying Stoneboy um, is just faking or, to him. Stoneboy is faking. Uh, that tweet was sending some fake um, congratulations to uh, people who never disrespected their seniors in the music industry, like how Stoneboy disrespected his seniors. But uh, these people have now won an award and Stoneboy is congratulating them. <laughs> it's a problem. So it was like it was going on, uh, on, on and off, back to back, I would say, on Twitter. And Stoneboy to reply the tweet <laughs> by saying the beef has started <laughs> on Twitter. It was a whole lot. It was all fun. But uh, actually, um, it's supposed not to be so. But here, let me share my thought here on what Samini uh, uh, said. Or he, he, Samini replied to Stoneboy tweet congratulating them. Yes, I know you have a problem with Stoneboy. I know in some way Stoneboy used some words on you. Uh, that um, actually I did not like it. Like, uh, I know how Stoneboy started. I know you and Stoneboy were cool until recently that there have been some misunderstanding between the two. But you, Samini, as a senior, sometimes, you know, you must show the way for, um, I would say, we always say leaders show the way for the rest to follow. So you are a leader, let me put it that way. So you must show the way. So to me, there was no need for you uh, to the time that actually how you replied to his tweet actually is, is, is I would say it was unnecessary you know we know you have a problem you know Stoneboy in some way when you were having this uh, sort of misunderstanding you used some words on like sell out and stuff that supposed not to have um, uh, to have come from him but uh, actually that thing came from his mouth or he said those words or he used those words but that forum or that place when we all Africans or when especially Ghanaians are all praying for unity in the music industry so that we can reach that peak in music and you come out replying to him in such a manner it's deepening the division in the music industry so I know yes there's a problem between the two but i think that time is not appropriate for such a reply i understand i know how uh, painful it is like helping someone or maybe uh, discovering someone and later maybe to turn some way but sometimes too, there's a need to show leadership regardless of or to show seniority regardless of how um, the differences between the two you know, this is what I've said. This is why I always say 
Nigerian musicians say, you will see they have problems. Yeah, but all the time, you put your personal interests aside and think always about um, how their music industry will grow. You know, you see, um, uh, um, the video is not in good terms, actually, with um, a Banner Boy. I would say personally because they fought recently in Ghana and uh, thank God that it wasn't bloody because uh, timely intervention of uh, I think those at the club at that time if not that actually it would it would have turned to something very bad but yes still they have bad blood between the two but when uh, uh, Bernard Boy won the award go and check the video he's straight he is even happy and saying that this is a win for Nigeria. So he's so happy and he congratulated them. That is how it's supposed to be. So even if you have problem with Stoneboy, and we know, yeah, we have problem, you have problem with him. We know, yes, you are his father, godfather in music. Yes. Yeah, but this is not the time in the public space where we all are celebrating and Ghanaians are thinking of how we can make our music so attractive because we have the talents i mean you have the talent you have won a more i think muba award or something before um stone boy bet um, uh, 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 and uh, i think um it's something that we it, it, it's, it's a great achievement you know but we have to go further than that you know but all this sort of backbiting and uh, superiority, I am top, I am this, is what is affecting our music industry. So, Sami, Charlie, you are talented. Me, I like you as a person. But actually, as for this one, dear, I will never support you, regardless of uh, maybe the problem you have with Stoneboy. But I will never support you on this. You know, this is the time isn't right for you to... Uh, respond to Stoneboy or maybe resurrect the uh, beef that you have with Stoneboy. The time is the time is not right, my bro. So I mean, it's not right at all. And I totally, um, I think I disagree uh, with you on your reply to uh, Stoneboy. You know, this is not the right time. Yes, there have been problems. Stoneboy have said something maybe you're not happy about, but there, I don't, I don't get it. You know, this time that we are preaching, we, me, I'm very happy. You know what? I don't have to be Nigerian before I have to be happy for the guys. This sort of things, we will say it's Nigeria, but it's for Africa as a whole. Huh? It's for Africa as a whole. So that is what we, we, we must all celebrate, you know? There's no need to be here and there, uh, here, there. Oh, man. Sami, my bro, this one, there, you know, for us. I will tell you my mind. You know, for Scra. A stone make you also be cool, eh? eh be cool. And uh, regardless of whatever, let's celebrate this together. It's a win for Africa. You know, it's a win for. Just check your colleagues in Nigeria. You see, all of them are celebrating it. You know, Nigeria, they are doing this. They have their differences, but they will all praise what have happened. Next time, you see it to be the turn of another person in Nigeria. You see, all the time, in the music music industry, music-wise, you see them always on top, regardless. But when it comes to music, we do a lot of good music. Isn't, it's not like they are doing any good song, but they are focused. They, yes, it's not like they are doing better songs than S or the margin is wide, no. Yeah, but they are focused. They are serious and very passionate. And you know, they put the music, the music industry ahead of everything. So, let's chill and celebrate the two. Eh? It's a plus for Africa. Okay.